Well, good morning, sunshines. So, it's crazy early. Uh, I got uh, two days of travel, business travel. Figured I'd take you along. Should have been three days or four days. I felt like it would been a good idea to get up the crack of dawn to travel so I could minimize the amount of days I'm away from home. So, yeah, we're doing this. Stay right there. Shot down, baby. Just waiting on my ride now. So, manual, no manual feed. Check it out. And then it's automatic, so if I just stop, it'll keep feeding to keep the wire there, but it won't just dump it. So, even though I just sat there, you'd never know I sat there for two seconds. Mm -hmm. So I know a lot of you guys are going to ask, this is similar to cold wire TIG welding, uh, except for that Furnius has some kind of voodoo technology where it can auto sense how much wire you need. So you can slow down, speed up, it's called dynamic wire, and it basically just does all the filler feed for you. It is pretty magical. So literally just got to my room, it's 5.30. I left my house this morning at three o'clock and I think I think I'm an hour behind here and so it's just like 6 30 at home just got to my room my legs are killing me we literally spent time in the lab all day today welding some awesome new equipment coming coming out actually I think it's already out available but some features aren't 100% out yet I'm gonna have it at Fabtech and that's really the reason I'm here I'm gonna be doing a demo at Fabtech on Wednesday morning 10 o'clock in the Fronius booth. You gotta come check it out. You'll see some of this stuff in this video. You'll see the, anyway, it's just their crazy new TIG setup that actually feeds the wire in for you. 
And the thing that's cool is it's not just a static feed and you have to like chase it the whole time. It's smart. It can sense the puddle. If you stop, it stops or it moves real slow. You start moving the puddle, it starts feeding it in there. I mean, it is, it's super smart. It doesn't even feel like, like when you're welding, it feels perfect. Like you don't feel any issues with it whatsoever. It's, it's almost, it feels like cheating. That's the best way to, to put it. So it's really cool. We did stainless, a bunch of stainless today. I think we're gonna play with it a little bit tomorrow. Um, but we'll have it at Fabtech in their booth. We're gonna do a demo, you can come check it out, you can come play with it. I think they're gonna let everybody play with it. So if you're gonna be at Fabtech in a couple weeks, you need to come by. I'll be there, like I said, Wednesday morning, 10 o'clock, which I'll probably be hanging out there as well, but I think we're gonna do a demo specifically at 10 o'clock, so. I think Dabs will be there at four o'clock on Wednesday, and then Justin will be there on four o'clock on Tuesday, I believe is his spot. So anyway, y'all come see us. Um, anyway, gotta go eat. I only had like 10 minutes in my room. Gonna go meet everybody and eat. I'll try to include some, maybe some footage from that, and then tomorrow we're back in the lab again, at least for half day or something, and then I fly back. It's kind of a marathon whirlwind. Okay, where if you did not give you the hole, it's there, but what button combo to press, you're not going to Yeah.